on the 8th, I believe, um, if I'm not mistaken. So no, there's no deadline. Any other questions about the web quest? Um, I think I lost the uh, Camtasia there. It crashed. Uh, but you should have sound now. Any other questions about the web quest, about MoveNote that I just uh, explained? If you could add that in the chat. Uh, let me know if there are any questions. For those of you who came late and are able to see, uh, what I discussed was evaluating with rubrics and doing the conclusions with MoveNote. I went through uh, a little bit of the introduction task process resources before going into evaluation and conclusion. And then I uh, gave a demo of um, a little bit about rubrics from Carnegie Mellon and the link, I shared the link in the chat box. And then the advantages of using rubrics and examples. I gave examples from my own website called uh, the Perfect Society, a book based on Lois Lowry's The Giver. And I showed that the evaluation is divided into three, 25 for individual tasks reports, 50 points for the team report. These are both written, so 75% is written, and 25 is the oral presentation, but it's team presentation where everybody has to present. And then the conclusion, how perfect was the society and the giver? It, two questions. Did Jonas do the right thing by leaving the community? And then, of course, I added a reflection. Then I shared this website and how they do it, not using MoveNote, and how you can add audio to the content using MoveNote. Okay, that was basically the slides that uh, I went through up now. So are there any questions? I see, Batul, you have your hand up. Um, I could pass on the mic to you. I'm not sure whether you're, you've got a headset or not, but uh, you would need a headset so that we don't echo. So let me know in the chat if you'd like to speak and ask a question or add your comments. Web quests are amazing. They're amazing because they're transformational. They allow students to learn about themselves, to learn about working together with others, teaming up. They learn about time management. So there's a lot of value. And teachers are able to watch as their students are actively working. And that's the greatest gift that can get is watching his or her students actively engaged in learning about different things and raising questions and being curious and showing wonder. So you are losing sound. I have no idea why, but um, as I said, oh, Thomas, now you're on the... Um, I see Thomas uh, is on the desktop. Thomas, is the desktop any better? And I hope you're using the desktop with Firefox or with Explorer. Uh, Dejabril, I suggest you get Fire. You get uh, the desktop with IQ. It's completely free, and you're having problems. If you still have problems, connect with with IQ. Okay, Wiz IQ. Contact Wiz IQ support at Wiz IQ or contact me or contact me at Nelly Deutsch at gmail dot com and I will help because I can see that the bar my bar is going up and down everything seems to be fine. 
okay so please contact me uh, the course feed for this uh, course uh, let me share that with you there's the link to the course okay so join uh, blend learn to blend and flip with technology and use the um, course feed to ask questions ask questions okay and keep asking questions if you're having problems with you need to know about blogs about move note blogs actually blogger to be specific blogger move note what else do you need you need to know about the parts of a web quest parts of a web quest that's all you need to know okay and how to use blogger web quest okay this is the course i'll add the link again okay so let me just write this this is the link to the course okay there that's the link to the course um okay de Jibril. any other questions you can feel free to add them in the chat if you want links um here is the link to the powerpoint presentation let me add that a link to the oops to the ppt whoops okay here's the link to the ppt what else do you need um blogger here is blogger okay so here is the link to blogger here is the link to blogger to do your web quest and um move note oh here's the link to my here it is it's ready okay let me just screen share very quickly so you get a chance to see this i'm going to screen share okay let me take away my face there okay let me screen share so i can take you to the move note that you saw before all right so let me take you to the move note okay here's the move note and uh, the link that i can share okay so there's the link and notice you can share this okay if you want to listen to it here it is hello everybody, hello, everybody. i'd like to introduce you to my spring blog festival and you're all invited uh, these are the presenters it's a, the presentation is going to take place from march 14 to march 16. you can you can see these okay i stopped it but you can send through gmail you can um Go to the settings, change the settings, change background, file presentation, edit slides. Okay, this is what you can do. You can also you can also share it on Facebook, on Twitter, uh, Google Drive, LinkedIn, and more. Okay, you can also share it with these other things. So lots of places that you can share. Okay, your link. Okay, this particular link. Notice it's audio with a PowerPoint presentation and I showed how that's done in addition here's the evaluation with perfect society rubrics and this marvelous web quest so let me stop sharing and here is the move note I'm adding it okay let me just tell you what this is this is move note okay there's move note I also want to share with you uh, the perfect society evaluation okay so here is the perfect society evaluation let me share that with you okay the perfect society let me tell you what this is this is the perfect society web quest uh, evaluation and you can also get and conclusion you can also get the conclusion there too all right so there's the link to that oh what else is here ah and then we've got the melon 
okay the carnaby not melon the carne carnegie melon so this is carnegie melon i hope you're getting all this carnegie melon okay website with the rubrics everything about rubrics okay that i used and then there is this wonderful web quest and the evaluation here okay sample web quest okay this is a sample web quest with evaluation and conclusion a web quest is a wonderful way as i said before to get your students uh, actively engaged in learning so uh, i see a lot of people have joined now i wonder if there was a problem joining so i um, and i see oh wonderful digibril can you hear me now give me a thumbs up if you can hear me with your desktop okay let me know uh, if you can hear me thumbs up can you hear me okay can you hear me can you hear and see me okay thumbs up okay let me know if you can hear and see me because i see that dejabril and marco have their desktops which is excellent so I'm still waiting to hear from you guys. I don't want to refresh my page because I know if I refresh it, I'm going to lose. You can't? All right, so I'll refresh my page. All right, let me refresh it. Okay, I'll refresh my page. In the meantime, let me just stop. Um,